seriously. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, Alice. Alice, really? Are you fucking serious? Go, Alice. Go. No, no. go, go, go. Go, go. Out. go out here. Come on. I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. Thank you. What are you doing? And now we continue. Hey everybody, hey Justin Dan here, and welcome back to more Detroit Becomes Human. On the last part, we escaped Salako's creepy ass house of infinite creepiness. Spoiler alert, we killed the fuck out of him. So I'm, I'm pretty sure, like, I atoned to kidnapping a little girl and robbing a convenience store. I'm pretty sure we can, we can successfully add murder to our list of fucked up things we do as Kyra. So, yep, now we're going back as Connor, and we're going to be talking- Oh, wait, she gone? Oh, what the fuck? Oh. Where the fuck she go? It felt like old lady here that was like supposed to be like our, our handler or something like that. She's gone now. We just gotta find her again. I know what the fuck she needs. So don't forget to click that subscribe button, everybody, and that cool bell thing on the side. So you always say uh, so you can always say notified. And let's do <coughs> <coughs> Oh gosh, oh. I don't know why, but I've been sick. But the past few days I've been sick. Like my body has like, actively tried to kill me. Like, my body's actively tried to kill the fuck out of me. I don't know why. Like I woke up and had a calm. Next day, fucking my stomach, like having a boxing match with my throat. You know, I, I, I don't know why. You ever have to think like you, when you eat something, but you don't know why, but your body's like not having any of that shit. Like your stomach is like, uh, uh Hello, not Amanda. It. Oh, hey, Amanda. Hi. I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? Uh, sure. I can always use to touch my legs. Umbrella. So she like the police chief? Not a, like like commissioner, like. The head of the police department, or like the head of like the robot police department. Seem to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. Wow. Uh, explain myself. Deviants are completely irrational, which makes it difficult to anticipate their behavior. And I had to save my partner. But I should have been more effective. I had to save my partner. You didn't like... manage to learn anything. Um. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Yes. Yeah. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed yeah, RA9. with RA9. So they have their own What list. else? Birds. It was fascinated by birds. We've seen deviants interested in other life forms, like insects or pets. But birds? But nothing like this. You came very close to capturing that deviant. Yeah, I'm very close, actually. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? Actually, kind of well, actually. He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. Yeah. He's been very positive, actually. He's been, like, a very, very great guy. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. What? I will solve this investigation, Amanda. It's like saying cr like I murder is on the hive. I want you to stop all murder. Like, like just what? Find Anderson and investigate it. Copy that. Copy that. Ooh, more investigating! I fucking love Carter's part. I really do. I love the whole investigating section. But basically she's like, oh, she's basically saying murder is on the rise. Stop all murder. Like, I, I, I can't, I can't stop all, I can... I can investigate and put away the murders, but I can't stop all murders. Like, I can't stop Deviant from doing what they do. Like, I can control Deviant. I'm not Ultron. What do you think I am? You have Step out. Ugh. Wait, 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 wait. I, I'm, wait. I'm like a high-ranking cop, but yeah, I have to write a tactic to them. Oh, never mind. This is how. Okay, never mind. I thought we were going to the crime scene already. I'm about to say, like, like, why are we not in a police car or something like that? Like, why the fuck are we not in, like, official police car? Imagine, like, you get arrested and the cop comes in a taxi. Like, all right, you're under arrest. Get a taxi. Is that it? Anybody home? Find a way. Is that bringing it? Bring one more time. I can do this all day, dude. No, all right. I thought, I was, I thought you were just going to hold the button. Okay. So we're going so to break. I realize we're breaking so many laws in this game. We're a cop. Yeah, we're breaking so many laws. So, I can't really tell if that is. He's sleeping? Maybe? 
Maybe if they think maybe it's like watching TV or something. I'm not really quite sure, but I I'll, I'll, I'll think bringing and entering into our partner's house is really a good sign. Like, is that really a good sign? Oh shit! Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, All right, now we can break in, Edward. Now we can break in. Ugh. All right, let's go. And break in, Edward. Ooh. Easy. Oh, easy, dude. Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? Why, why is he being scared? He's a, he's a robot. Like. I'm here to save your owner. Yeah, I'm here to like save that. He is dead as fuck, yeah. and I am here to save that. Ugh. Get up! Get up! Get up! There we go. Is he drunk? Check on Hank. Is he passed out drunk? This drunken motherfucker. This drunken motherfucker. Oh, that better not be vomit. That better not be fucking vomit. Did he vomit? Did he fucking vomit? Oh, heart. It's not trauma, so he's good. Alright, so. <laughs> Trace of alcohol. Yeah, he's drunk as fuck. I like that, like, knocked out pose. Ugh. Ugh, the whiskey was too strong. Black Lamb. I mean, Jack Dan. Oh, oh, whoa! Oh, so. Lieutenant. Slap his ass up! Wake up! Slap him! <laughs> wake up, Lieutenant! Wake up! Wake up, you drunk bitch! Oh! It's me, Connor! Call me Daddy! How about. Can I slap him again? I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! I have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Yeah, I'm sorry, but, like, I need you sober and not drunk off Thank you ass. in advance for your cooperation. Leave get the fuck out of here! Yeah, uh, nah. Come on, yeah. hey. Let's go. Let's get you sober up, buddy. Attack! Good job. Attack! Yeah, come on. Let's go, buddy. You're drunk and ass in the bathroom. Ugh. Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Yo, no shit! You're drunk off your dumb ass. Come on, buddy, in there. In you go. Uh, uh, and you go. Oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. You ain't going in that bathroom. And, oh my god. Are you fucking serious, dude? Get your. I will fucking. Shave it or not. Doing? I'm getting you sober. Now fucking get in that bath. No, either you take your clothes off or we do it the hard and kick you away. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. Go on, Sam. So, are we not gonna take his clothes off? Are we not gonna be kinky? Okay, fuck. Ah! Ah! Turn it off! Turn it off! Nope. Ah! Ah, there we go. Are you done? Are you sober? Are you not a dumbass anymore? What the fuck are you doing here? I had to escape your ass! Homicide was reported. Ah, fucking alarm! Stop it, Moan! I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking ass. You were drunk off your ass, unconscious. We thought you were you dead. Just leave me alone. Rational. Unfortunately, I cannot. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've no. been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case, Lieutenant. You're not yourself. You should beat it. You hear me? Get the hell out of here. Jeez, nah. I understand. Dead. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. Uh oh. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some. That's uh, what I thought. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. Uh huh. That's what I I'll thought. Go Come on, let's go. We know you can't stay away from the case like this. Oh, you fucking horn dog. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, like, I love the whole buddy cop. They need to, they need to make, like, a, like, a, like a show with Connor and Hank. Like, what fucking, do you want to wear? Like, lethal weapon, but with hippie, stripe, or streaky. You know what? You know what? Let's go with stripey. Let's go with this. Gonna walk in, they're gonna walk into the strip club all sleazy and shit. I'm on, dude. Time to roll this joint. We want to see some titties. <laughs> oh, yeah, come on, bomb it out, bomb it out. Are you all right, Lieutenant? No, I'm drunk off my ass. The fuck you mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Good. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. 
Oh, oh, that's gross. Okay. Well, um, time to uh, well, we already broke it. Edward's house. Let's uh, let's go sneak around. Let's see, what, see, what, see about shit. Oh, flattering. Ugh. 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 Cor Ugh. I got the core flakes in my mouth. Oh, so disgusting. Oh god. Oh, you ever like eat something really good, but then like you burp or some shit, and you taste it again, and it's just not as good as you remember it. It's like, oh, oh gosh, it tastes like fucking. Ugh. It tastes like a dying. Plant mixed with an even worse dying plant. Oh gosh! Oh, what? 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 Why does cornflakes taste that nasty for some reason? No, I, I love cornflakes. Like I, I fucking love cornflakes, but not when you burp it up. Ugh. So, what else am I supposed to know about? I'm like, okay, he's a drunk. Oh, you pet the doggo. Pet the doggo. Who's a good doggo? Who's a good doggo? Yes, you. You. You a good doggo? That's right. You a good doggo. You a real good doggo. A good doggo. That's right, that's right, you're the good doggo. You're the good dog. I fucking love dogs, holy shit. Do dogs and cats are two favorite animals. I love dogs because they're so energetic. They're so energetic, so playful. I love cats because they're so self-sufficient, they're so, like, bonding, though. I, I was gonna say loyal, but with dog, like, more loyal. Cats are a lot more bonding. Because my cat, like, won't leave me alone. I, lo I love and I hate that. Like, you're a jazz fan. Like, my cat is like, I love that I hate it, that like, he doesn't leave me alone. I love the fact that he does that, because it's like, it's, it's so like, comforting and charming. It's like, oh, oh, who's a good cat, who's a good cat. But sometimes it's also annoying, because it's like, there are times where, where you're just like, like, come here, come on, just, oh, no wait, leave, leave me alone, like, five seconds, like, five seconds. Like, but doesn't even have a cat. Like, isn't it weird that when you go to the bathroom, the cat, like, follows you into the bathroom, or just like, waits outside, and just like, just waits there for you? I'm like, um, I'll, 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 I'll be there in a minute. Question. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Um. Want to see how long I can last? Yeah, um. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. Oh, fuck. So he's suicidal. No, 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 no. I want to, I want to literally take the gun. I'll be like, yeah, nah, I'm not having, I'm not, you're not having this shit. The cool looking gun, too. I, I, I want to. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so he's suicidal. Let me pull his chair up. Let me look all nice. There we go. Okay, can we like can we tidy up? This place is a shithole. No offense, Hank, but your place is a shithole. And sorry about the window, Lieutenant. I really thought you'd been attacked. Of course, Cyberlife will pay for the damage. Yeah. <laughs> but... Yeah, imagine like you going to imagine like you said a bit to that. Oh my gosh, um yeah, we need a rec recapitulation for a window. Why? You see, when your Android thought I was dead and just fucking burst through that shit like FBI style. So I'm gonna need some reimbursement for that shit. Oh hey, you good? Are you okay, Lieutenant? Oh. Oh. Um, I'm gonna pretend that was vomiting and not something else. Oh, Oh, you ready to go? Snappy. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Yeah, I'll give like five, maybe ten minutes. Don't worry, Sumo, I'll be back. I'll give you a nice pet down. How about, how about, how about this? I'll be back, but with treats. How about that, huh? No, you get it. That was it? Really? That was it? I was really fucking short, even for this. That was really short, even for this game. This is kind of short. Even for this game. I want to go back to Connor! I want to go back to- I want to see the strip club! I want to go back to the strip- Oh, we're playing back as well. Okay. Not oh, fuck. Actually, yeah. I, I just remembered. I just fucking remembered that we have to actually uh, do some, like, Payday 2 high shit. I want to see how that's going to turn out. Like, we don't have any guns. We don't have any, we don't have any weapons. None of that. So we're basically going to steal it vanilla style. How the fuck are we going to do this? This is crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. So don't, don't catch us. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Okay, but show me, like, you know, how to sort of, like, weapons or something like that, something to protect ourselves? Doesn't say shit gets real? Like, maybe, I don't know. I mean, like, the four-man group, you know. I play, I, play, I play a few rounds of payday in my day. So, you know, maybe some weapons, something like that, you know. Something like, well, you know, somebody spots us. You can hold them as hostage, so or maybe like tie a bus so it doesn't say anything. Don't let them see us. 
Yeah, no shit. Like, I'm pretty sure us breaking and entering into a place, I'm pretty sure they don't want anybody to see us. Pretty fucking sure. So how about you shut the fuck up and let me do this, okay? I'm the one who played Payday 2. I'm the one who played GTA. Okay, you know what? I know what I'm doing. Okay, I know exactly what I'm doing. I guess I go, but... Watch out. Thanks for that. Now what do we do? I'll find another way. So park oh, how can I park one time? Oh, yeah! This green! This is green! You know, I always want to do this. I always want to, like, go to, like, a giant warehouse and just start parkouring on the boxes. I'm pretty sure I can't do that because I'm, 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 I'm pretty sure it's illegal. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can start trespassing. But I want to try at least once. Like, like if, yeah, guys, if you, can, if you can commit one crime, like, you can get away with it. Like, commit any crime you want, but you can get away with it just once. Like, one crime without any consequences, what would it be? For me, it'll probably be... I don't know, I honestly don't know. It'll probably like be either... Oh, it's not gonna be I'll probably be either... Robbery or murder? What else do? Not like small robbery, like, like hide robbery, like freaking rob a giant bank or something like that. Like something like that. If I get like legit, like if I get like a like a gal jail free card, I'll definitely try rob. I'll definitely rob a bank, definitely. Gal jail free. I'll, no, I'll do it GTA boss style and everything. I like I like wear the mask and everything. Like, all right, hands up. All right, I want the money in the bag. Come on, money in the bag. Let's go. Okay, don't jump it. Take away the easy route. I'll ignore her. I'll ignore her. She knows what she's doing. She, she sees Assassin's Creed. She knows her Assassin's Creed. Ugh. Alright guys, ready? This is green! This is green! Alright, there's the warehouse. Cyber Life warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First we have to get rid of that drone. How? We can't just shoot it down. Leave it to me. How? Wait. We can't shoot it down because we don't have any weapons. That might like, you know, cause distraction. So, we just have to sneak around it. That's a bad idea. Let's check it out. We'll be spotted. Yeah, that's a really bad idea. we we'll be seen on the spot. What if we go from the top? It would be too high. Nah, yeah, it's too high for us. What if we go to the side? We jump on the side. Wait for that there, jump off of that, and then boom, on the, on the drone. Will that work? Boom. And then... Boom. No, it's too high. Fuck it. Then... We go onto the side here. Oh, that's how we do it. And then... To the drone? No. Too far away, we fall. Does that mean Assassin's Creed? And then it comes. But what the drone like? But what it like? Wait, but what the drone like? Like, be alerted that something happened to it? Like, okay. Uh, uh, that's the screen! And uh, that's the screen! Ah, uh, come on! That's the screen! Oh! Uh, they have back the shit! Oh, there we go. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. But what it like? Good job. Set an Mr. alarm that the drone is offline. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Okay. No, it's not the crates. God. It's crates. What? It's crates. Wait, wait, wait. I'm looking. I'm trying to search the crates. The crates won't let me search anything. There we go. Come on. Come on up. Well, we have a knife the whole time? All right, come on, come on. For anybody see, for anybody see. What happened, we good? Oh shit. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. No, you will not. John! God damn machine. Where is it this time? Kill guard. I'm gonna hide. John! I need your help. 
John! Oh, fuck the pipe. Oh, no, 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 I should, oh, fuck, no, I should release him. First the drone, now this. Never mind. Just my luck. Never mind. Oh, I'm about to say, like, I should release him. So I can be like, oh, I'm here. And, like, lure him away. Let's finish up and get out of here. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, I should have, like... Try to find some blue blood. Ah, uh, I wonder if I, wait, if I release him, would he alert it? Or could I just, like, convince him, like, hey, you know, let him, like, you know, lure him away? I don't think, I don't think he would. No, I, I think, I don't think it was a good show. Because they're, now they're away. You know, they ain't they cheese and shit. They're not... Like the bigger crate. A big crate. Uh, uh, oh, 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 it took a while. Take me a while, sorry, my assassin's creating is lacking. Oh, fuck, oh, damn it! Uh, there we go. Come on! Uh, 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 is this easy? Wow, this is easy. Payday 2 makes it look a whole lot harder than it has to be. I'm like, alright, you're free now. You're one of us. Okay. I didn't know we could just do that. Let's touch him like you're free now. Carry. Let's go. Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. Except they come with us. Yeah. You can always use that. You can always use like no more. I know where you can find more spare parts. See? What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Uh, uh, and you want to leave him here? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. So double or nothing? Double, we double or nothing this? Get the key. Yeah, we got the key! Wait here. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Yeah. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. Yeah. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. Yeah. It's better for us. Yeah, it's better, basically better for me to go alone, because if they see me and they kill me, then, like, you, you guys still have it. But we're going to do that in the next part, guys. I mean, come back, we're going to be firing the key to the trucks and getting a whole shit to the bomb components for Jericho. And hopefully, going back to Kara's story. Can I actually really just to find out what the fuck's gonna happen with Kara now? Because is she gonna cross the border? And she's like, that. Is it all gonna be good? Or are we gonna have some more complications, more creepy ass dudes with robot armies of nightmares in his basement? So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to click that, click that subscribe button, everybody. And that cool bell thing on the side. So you always can stay notified. I'll be see you guys in the next awesome Android failed part. Peace out, everyone. Bye 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 bye. <laughs>